biggest smile of the day, knowing he doesn't have to talk about the unrest in the boardroom. Mm. That's for certain, because if you win, nothing else matters. Interesting answer there, Tim, about Robert Sanchez, their goalkeeper. It's felt for a while that Chelsea have been searching yep. for a number one. Do you think they have finally found them? Uh, I think possibly. I think part of being a number one is, is uh, exuding confidence to your back line. Also having an understanding of what the manager wants. He spoke there about when to play long, when to play short, particularly in possession. He has all the, he has all the tools. You know, they brought in Jurgensen to maybe push him to be number one. But right now, I see no reason. He made some big saves today, and we saw that. The Chelsea job, Robbie, yeah. is always a massive job. Absolutely. This season, mm. and actually for the last couple of years, it's felt not just massive, but incredibly hard. Yeah. And it's interesting that a man with such little experience has been given that opportunity. Absolutely. And the thing I would say, Bex, is it's an unconventional team. It's an unconventional club. They don't do it by the norm. But that shouldn't mean we criticise. That shouldn't mean they, they will fail. There's a decent group of players. There's a decent young manager who are all kind of learning on the job, but if collectively they stay together, collectively they continue to grow their identity, keep the possession, be a bit smarter playing out the back. There's a team in here, there's a decent team here, there's a young team that can grow, that can, could become a bit of a force in, in English football. Yeah, it's an interesting watch at the moment, mm. that is for certain. Robbie Earl, Tim Howard, thank you very much. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host of NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And if you want even more Premier League content from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock.